Hey there, Diogo from Etiak here and today we are doing a walkthrough of the onboarding process so you can get started on your new Etiak account. So let's go ahead and get started. After your first login, you'll see a little introduction screen and your first step will be adding a domain. You can add as many domains as you want, as long as you want them. And you can get started simply with your main uh, organization domain. So in this case, let's proceed with acne.com. And after this, we need to verify the ownership of your domain. Now, this is so that the artificial hackers can detect changes in your digital infrastructure and then proceed with the black box test testing. If you do want to add gray box texting in the future, you can do so. We have detailed videos on how to do that. And to do that, you just add credentials, login credentials to your portal. But for now, we'll stick to black box testing. And to do that, you, all you need to do is add the ATIAC domain record to your domain name settings. Now, you just copy these values uh, or you can send the instructions to a developer or someone who has management permissions in your DNS. And once that's done, you just click verify. And since this is a demo account, it works automatically. And once we can verify your ownership, you can add domains as in scope or out of scope. And you have full control over what gets tested and what doesn't. But uh, after you've done so, you can continue. And the last step is just taking a look at our terms of services, where we detail our policies in um, so for use of the artificial hackers and the human hacking. And once you've read them and you agreed with them, you can launch your Etihad portal. And that's it for onboarding. You are in and now you can start launching human hacking events. The artificial hackers will begin testing your assets and in a few hours you'll start getting the first vulnerabilities reported inside the portal in case that you do have them. That's it. Thank you for watching and as always, if you have any questions, do not hesitate to reach out to our support team. Thank you.